Hello, sports fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. And I'm recording this video on opening day 2020. Except it was an opening day with no games. All right, pal, we're cleaning the grease fryer. We don't have any French fries today. Oh, okay, uh, then just give me a small order of fries, please. Look, Chief, maybe you didn't hear me. I said we don't have any fries today, so how about something else? Opening day 2020 is going to go down in history as a very sad day for baseball fans. Like me, and like many of you, so, it's the lost opening day. So when will opening day be? We don't know. Um, I've heard that it was going to be that the season might start um, mid-June. That's one of the latest things that I've heard. So, um, that's still a while off. So that's going to be uh, kind of a bummer. Now, there's been other opening days, I think, that have been wiped out. I think there was a, uh, a lockout one year, so baseball didn't start on time. Hasn't happened a lot, though. And i got to say, I don't like it. I mean, I was off on opening day. I was off Thursday, Friday. Well, uh, yeah. Thursday and Friday. I mean, I'm always off on Saturday and Sunday. But um, I was off. I took Thursday and Friday off in anticipation of the White Sox starting their romp to the American League Central Division title. And, uh, well, now that romp is going to be put off a little bit. So we, in the meantime... We have to fill the time. Um, leave a comment below. Let me know what you've been doing. Um, you know, because there's no sports. There's no, Not only is there no opening day, there's no basketball, there's no hockey, there's no hockey playoffs coming anytime soon. So let me know what you've been doing uh, to fill the time. I've been watching, you know, I pull up on YouTube, um, like baseball seasons, I've been watching that. I love those. I love the memories that the baseball seasons bring back. But I love the memories that, um, you know, opening day can make for you. Because I take every opening day off that I can. Now, I have missed a few in the past uh, because at work there was something going on. Um, the one year opening day, I was supposed to report to a different office. I had diff we are my organization had different offices in the DC area and I was starting at a different office for the organization on um, opening day so that year I couldn't do it there was another year where I had something due um, for a contract proposals or something were coming in so I had to miss that one but it, ha it doesn't happen often and I had taken these two days off, Thursday and Friday, um, the, uh, you know, the, the first of those being the opening day. I had taken those off in anticipation of it actually being opening day. And it didn't happen. And now we knew it wasn't going to happen. So, yeah, I've been filling the time watching baseball seasons. Um, I've been filling the time watching Who's Number One on ESPN Classic. Um, even once in a while, pulling up an old game. There was, uh, the other day I was watching, uh, game, I think it was game five of the 1984 National League Championship Series between the, uh, Padres and the Cubs. Loved it. I love the memories that all that stuff brings back. And um, several years ago, I was told by, well, many years ago, this was many years ago, I was told by my grandmother that my grandfather used to do the same thing. He would take opening day off. 
Although, I don't know exactly what he did on opening day because he lived in Syracuse. So he was nowhere near a major league team. And um, if he was taking opening day off, I mean, what? To listen to the games on the radio? I mean, that's about the best I could think he was doing. So I don't know. Uh, but, you know, he used to do the same thing. And uh, just a very sad, sad opening day for me. Um, and, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm getting ready for my seasons, like my Stratomatic seasons. Thank God for those, because they um, are going to start on time, just like they would. We got the Elmwood season starting um, on Saturday, Saturday morning. The games for the first week will be run. And we have the, um, well, the other two, the other two leagues I'm in, I'm not sure when opening day is going to be. Um, but the Elmwood League starts this um, Saturday. So my, uh, my Providence Grays will begin their march to mediocrity on Saturday. But um, at least it's, at least the season is starting on time. I mean, you know, that's something. Even if the White Sox were horrible, I would have rather had a horrible White Sox with opening day being when opening day was supposed to be and a 162 game schedule than a much better White Sox where the season starts in the middle of June and there's only like 100 games. So anyway, um, I just wanted to get all that off my chest like I said, leave a comment. Let me know what you've been doing um, and plan to do until sports come back. And we don't really know when that's going to be. We don't know if there's going to be NHL playoffs or when they'll start. We don't know when, for sure, when the baseball season's going to start. You know, like I said, I heard it was supposed to be they're aiming for mid-June, but who really knows? And... Um, so, yeah, um, just interested in what everybody's been doing. Um, for my part, I was just, you know, watching stuff on YouTube, watching old games and um, old shows about past seasons. But, um, yeah, leave a comment. Let me know what you've been doing. Let me know how hard it's hitting you that there's no baseball. And uh, we'll talk later. Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.